Hello everybody, welcome back. This will be my Ipsy versus Birch Box for April 2016. We'll start with the Ipsy bag. It's a nice looking bag. It's tie-dye effect. It has a nice liner. It's not something I would put in my purse, but Let's see I got two Perlissy uh, sheet masks. A blue lotus and white tea and a blue lotus and seaweed. I'm not a fan of the brand, but I am excited to try a sheet mask. What else do we have? I got a crown brush. It is a duo fiber tapered blush brush. It's very soft. I'm a fan of crown brushes. I think they're very well made and they are inexpensive. So I think they make a really nice product for the amount of money that you're going to pay for it. So yeah. Always excited to get a new brush. Let's see what else is in here. I got Star Looks Jet Lux Longwear Eye Pencil. It's a screw up one. It's a very nice black. It looks really black. Let's try it on my hand. Oh wow, that's very smooth. It's very soft too. Very little pressure on my hand. Hopefully it'll look nice on my eye. Hopefully you can see that. But yeah, that's very pretty. It's a rarely it's a really rich black. I like that. Then I got a Tarte Lip Surgeon lip cream in wonder a pretty nice amount in there too let's try it it's a pretty red it's got a little pinky undertone so it's more of a berry which i really like that's very pretty so hopefully it translates well onto my mouth sometimes colors don't work like that and then the last item in my Ipsy bag is the City Color Highlight Trio. This is the colors. You got a nice little gold. Uh, it's more of a white base. And then this one's got a little pink to it. Let's try them. top is the gold one the white one and then the pinky one they're very pretty I hope you guys were able to see them and yeah, they're very pretty I think they'll make very beautiful highlights so I'm pleased with that that was a pretty cool ipsy bag I really like it So let's go to the birch box and this box was um, from Rifle Paper Co. They gave the design I guess. So let's see, I got five items in here as well. I got the Wren Clean Skin Care Keep Young and Beautiful Infant Firming Beauty Shot. I haven't tried the Ren products, but I guess this will plump your face up a little. You're supposed to use two or three drops to your clean face and then follow with your moisturizer. So apparently this, there's a generous amount of product in here, it lasts a while. That's pretty cool. Uh, this is the Brigio Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. I picked this one for the month. I really like the Brigio brand. I think they make really nice conditioning hair masks. I've had one before. I don't know if this was this one or if it was a different mask, but it came in a little jar. I really like that. Um, I have a perfume. It is by English Laundry. It's Notting Hill Femme. It's a 
pretty gold. Um, that's a nice fragrance. It's right now it's a little overpowering to me. Um, I don't know. It kind of reminds me of like cotton or linen. But there's something else to it that's like poof in your face. Um, it's not a horrible scent. I will use it till it's gone, but I would not buy this. This is not a scent that I would spend my money on. Then I got the PBJ Smoothie Stick. It's a creamy lip crayon. I have no idea what the color is. But that's what it looks like. So I'm going to swatch it below the black eyeliner, closer to my thumb. Oh, it smells nice. I like that. It's not a strong scent, but it's a nice scent. I like that. So, can you see it? It's this one right here. Did I get it in my finger? Okay. It's very pretty. It's very similar to the lip from uh the tarp that i just got in ipsy's so the this pbj one here is a little darker it's more of a wine than a berry i think so it's darker and the tarp one has a little more shine to it they're both very pretty and both very similar <laughs> hopefully you can see that Oh, and then my last product is supposed to be a Birch Box exclusive. It's the Marcel Micellar 3-in-1 solution, which is cool. I've never had a, I guess a name brand one, which is a lot. I have the Garnier one, which is a huge bottle. You know, I paid $7 for it. And this one, full size, is supposed to be 21 So it'll be interesting to try a, I guess, a luxury brand or high-end brand compared to the low-end brand of Garnier to see you know if I like one better than the other so that'll be a nice comparison so maybe one day you'll see about that in a video yeah so that is the end of my birch box and ipsy unboxing I'm pretty 50 50 on them they both had great products there wasn't anything that I disliked immediately so pretty good month for april let's see what may brings next month i want to thank you guys for viewing please hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed this video please subscribe i would love to have you hello to my new subscribers i want you guys to be safe be well peace